just beautiful out here today. Look at this, guys. How's it going? Mark Freeman 408. Welcome to Toby Tuesday. So if you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe, hit notifications. Every Tuesday, I answer fan questions and comments with my dog. So he's a German Shepherd. We hang out. He's cool. Um, but yeah, so every Tuesday, we like to answer all your guys' questions. I usually pick out six or seven kind of update you on what's going on and then I head over and grab him and we do a little photo shoot and answer all your guys questions so I'm heading down to Windsor dirt bikes right there I uh we me and Justin ripped off a whole bunch of cats off the car so I gotta take those to the scrapyard got some rocks there from the race on the weekend we just destroyed the Malibu someone suggested to do a Rockford a reverse Rockford over a jump so I tried it and it went well, but she's no longer drivable. So the Maverick's looking good. She's clean. The boys from Evil Power Sports sent us some stuff. So we got a blow off valve and a tuner. So this is going to be 200 horsepower. And I know you guys are going to be freaking happy because everyone's like, get a tuner, get a tuner, do this. I'm like, nah, I won't do it. And then, yeah. So they shot me a message and we worked out a deal and it's going to be fast. So that's going on Thursday. We got some heat wrap from Heat Shield products. So I'm gonna wrap up the muffler, keep her nice and cool down there. Other than that, that's, uh, that's the plan. So we've just been doing a ton of work, trying to get everything done. I know I haven't motoed much lately, but uh, I'm gonna start doing more moto videos. What's that? Hey, we're, we're just about to start our one hour activation. Nice, I'm just doing Toby Tuesday. Oh, okay, cool. So. Great. Right on. I forget what I was talking about now. <laughs> um, yeah, we're gonna start doing more moto videos. So I know I haven't been, I haven't rode in like a month. So we've just been so busy with everything else. But the bike, the bike is still there. The quad is still there, and the bike is still there. So I'm hoping to start getting out once or twice a week and doing moto. You know, everyone's just been so busy. Actually, no one's been riding. So that's why we haven't really done much. Oh. Looks like I hit something with the little clip there. <laughs> but yeah, so we're going to start doing more moto stuff. Hold on. So anyways, let's head over to Byron. We'll grab Toby and we'll uh, do Toby Tuesday here. Toby. Come on. Let's go for a ride. <laughs> Toby, Toby, Toby. Toby's been laying low lately because he hurt his foot. So he's just been, he's just been chilling. Hey. Okay. Not too much activity for you. We don't want you to to hurt yourself again. You gotta heal, buddy. You gotta heal. Yeah? How you been doing? You been good? Yeah? All right, let's go answer some questions. It is so nice out here. What do you think, Tobes? Beautiful out. Look at that poof of hair. <laughs> oh, the shatter. Hey, buds. How's it going? How's it going, buds? I like your mask. If anyone wonders why horses wear masks, it's because it keeps all the flies out of their eyes. Can you see all the flies on his nose? <laughs> they drive you nuts, eh, bud? Okay, I bet they do. Oh, fly went in my ear. All right, guys, if you're not outside, right? If you're not outside right now, you should get outside and enjoy this weather because it is amazing out, isn't it? Look at it, look at it. Take it all in. All right, questions. Oh, hey, bud. Hi. Hi. Hey. You're drooling everywhere, Tobes. You're drooling everywhere. Got you some hair. <laughs> uh, I hope you guys had a fantastic weekend. I sure did. We were up in uh, Muskoka. We went up to Bala. We saw July Talk at the Key. It was a good concert. It's actually the second time I've seen them up there. Um, and the third time I've seen them in general, I saw them at Rock the Park last year, then at the Key, then on the Key this year. So they put on a good show. And thank you for the Key for having us, because uh, it's a rock star bar now, so it's a lot of fun. So, hey, Tobes. Hey. How's it going? <laughs> Doobie. All right, questions. Um, Brian Morrow. Tomorrow is Brian. Tomorrow. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, jump the BMW. So, I wanted to, but I, I'm still debating it. I've never actually jumped a manual car, so I don't actually know how I would go about it. Probably, you know, put it in second or third gear. 
and then you know put the brick on the gas and then probably have to like use a snow brush or something and hold down the clutch and like release it out and it would probably burn the clutch a little bit on the way down but i'm a little worried because i never jumped one so i don't know how how i would go about it but yeah so hopefully i'm using toby's foot as a uh, paper holder there good foot on you Toby. good foot Anyways, so yeah, we're going to try to in the next week or two. You know, it got pretty banged up in the demo derby. The back wheel is pretty bent up. So she's still a good car. It's just the back's kind of effed. So we will try to do something soon with it. That's for sure. Um, up North Adventure. I think making the car jump bigger is a great idea. Also, you should jump a Jeep Wrangler. Yeah, so if you guys saw the video the other day, I want to bring in a dozer in August and uh, redo the whole track. It's it's a little hard to ride in the summer because everyone's so busy. So usually I'd wait like halfway through the summer. We redo the whole track and then, you know, we do riding at the end of the summer and in the fall. So, but yes, I want to make that car jump bigger. We've done so many cars. We've done so many car jumps. It's time to change it up. Go bigger. Go bigger and better. Right, Tobes? So, and then, uh, yeah, the Jeep Wrangler. I'll keep an eye out for Jeep Wranglers, you know. Uh, there's only so many cars on Kijiji and Facebook Marketplace, so um, if I do find one, I'll definitely pick it up and then uh, we'll we'll get it jumped. So, um, buried bruschetta. How much do you pay for cars? Well, that all depends. I do have a deal with the scrapyard. They give me they give me cars and then I I take them like we smash them and then we take them back after. So those don't cost me anything. But then I don't make anything off them. Only the video, right? So. Um, usually for cars that I've been buying, I'd spend about 150 to 300 bucks. The Durango was 600, but then I got 500 for scrap and the video made a few hundred bucks. So I was happy about that. But yeah, usually I spend 150 to 300 and then you take the cat and battery out. And then I usually get, uh, 250 to 500 at the scrapyard. So I get my money back. You don't have to worry about that. So, hey, Tobes. Hey, buddy. Hey, buds. Good dog. Um, next one, Richard Hartley. You should start saving all the airbags. Yeah, we did that for a little bit uh, at the start of the season. Then we kind of, I just forgot about them, actually, because we had so much bad luck trying to ignite those airbags. I think one or two went off. But, uh, yeah, definitely. Thank you for reminding me, Richard. I'll definitely start um, saving the airbags again, and we'll start doing some airbag videos, see if we can launch some stuff into space. Do some big explosions. Uh, Faded Jate. Were all the cars at the scrapyard your old victims? Yes. Um, not all of them, but I would say probably half. <laughs> half of those cars you see at the scrapyard are definitely ones we've jumped and destroyed and messed up. So, yeah, there's a lot of cars there now for sure. I think they're happy. They're getting lots of business from me. So, right, Tobes? Yeah, if you if you got any scrap, take it to Robson Scrap Metal in St. Mary's. Jeez, look at the bugs out here. Holy. All right, last question. Brad Shoemaker, you should drive the cars through the river. Oh, trust me, it's been thought about, but, uh, you know, the environmentalists, I'm sure, would have something to say about that, and if anything ever did happen, I'd feel bad if, you know, gas and oil went in the river, and I don't want to piss anyone off in that way, and I'm sure it wouldn't be that interesting. We'd probably end up in the river and just end up breaking something soon. We went in the river, and then nothing funny would happen so i do take the maverick through the river once in a while but uh other than that yeah we'll just stay out of the river with the cars for now so i don't want to piss anyone off right but anyways yeah what do you think Tobes? she is a scorcher out here i love it though i would rather uh i'd rather weather like this than you know cold and rainy and slushy since our winters have kind of gone to crap but Toby City. Oh, I wish it. I, I wish it rain. I can't tell if it's like my camera's underexposed or if my screen is just really, really dim right now. I think my screen is just dim because it's so bright out. But oh, Mr. Horse, he's dying right now. Look at all the bug or look at all the flies bugging him. Hey, buds, can we shoo the bugs off you? Yeah, there you go. There you go. <laughs> Oh, I bet that would be annoying. Anyways, Tobes, I'm going to uh, dump you off and we'll go. Uh, I got I to actually get back to the house. I'm going to edit four videos. I got 
three videos from the weekend then got to edit this one so we'll get all those edited slap them together and then i'm off to windsor for a few days and then next week the last few days of july first few days of august i'm heading up to amber's farm in uh, detour village michigan so if anyone lives up there maybe i'll see you i'm bringing the maverick and probably the dirt bike did you get a did you get a fly <laughs> Toby loves eating flies and bees. <laughs> Something's bugging him. Are you getting your Tobes? <laughs> All right, let's take you back and uh, we'll wrap this up. Thank you guys, as always. Make sure you check out the links below. Support the team. Go follow um, Evil Power Sports if you have a side-by-side. -side. They do amazing work. And I can't wait for the Maverick to be 200 horsepower. Hopefully I don't go through belts like a... Like, I don't know, like a grinder. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm excited. Hope you guys are excited. I'm excited for the rims and tires too, because that would be a nice setup. So that other Maverick, the uh, that red Maverick I was on had uh, rims and tires, and those are the exact same tires I'm getting. So I'm definitely excited for that. So anyways, have a fantastic day. Make sure you leave lots of comments. Thank you to all the new subscribers. Have a fantastic day, and we'll see you later. Later, tubes. <laughs>